Right, not with a double sock knot, you want to make sure that you have enough weight. So have it about shoulder width apart before making a hoop, uh, loop, sorry. Um, with the tail end, you want to wrap it around the loop before bringing it up through the middle, as such. Making a figure of eight, as so. You then want to make sure you go through the harness, and then go back through um, through the figure of eight, of, as, um, where you, um, sorry, through the figure of eight. So you want to go through, we go through, following around the rope. Like so. To make the figure of eight. Uh, from this point on, um, it's important to make sure that your knot is tight um, and look, uh, tight and tidy. Um, this is to make sure that not only will it support, it support you um, and be stronger, but it's also easier to undo um, at the end of your session or rock climbing um, excursion. Um, then you want to make a double stop knot. But so to do this, you want to put your thumb on the end of the knot um, and wrap the tail round your thumb twice and going back through the two looped pieces of rope. From there you want to make sure it's tight and closest to the knot as possible. Once you've done that, you tighten each individual rope to make it nice and tidy, like such. And the double stop knot is there to support the figure of eight if it becomes slippy or uh, untangles.